difference of the Y and the difference of the X, also known as rise over run. Divide the two and then reduce and you got slope, 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 slope. Difference of the Y and the difference of the X, also known as rate of change. Divide the two and then reduce and you got slope, 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 slope. When I'm sitting in math and I'm trying to find how to get the slope, the slope of a line, I think about delta Y and about delta X, I know if it's zero or undefined. One half slope, come on, one slope, come on, two slope, come on, three slope, come on. Hold up, wait a minute, do I see what I think I might? Got a negative slope in sight, it's going down from the left to the right. No big deal, the difference is slight, just write the ratio with a negative sign. When you have two points, you just have to check, it's y minus y over x minus x. I plug in my points, then simplify, the same problem, it's easy as pie. The difference of the y and the difference of the x, also known as rise over run. Divide the two and then reduce and you got slope, 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 slope. The difference of the y and the difference of the x, also known as rate of change. Divide the two and then reduce and you got slope, 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 slope. slope.